January 1, let's go, you know, what a way to get sick on the first day of the new year, but I asked for it, yeah, I brought it to myself, anyway, 2018, what we do is go fast, 500 miles an hour, see, it could be done in 5 seconds, you know, just dial in some lines, boom, 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 and zero, ciao. But we want to go legit, professional, like show you how to make stuff for real, not just like insert your number here. Anyway, empty CSV that doesn't crash the physics editor is right here. We got our engine stats right there. And the only thing that we are missing to begin is physics editor folder original exe open it we're gonna do notepad just for the demonstrational video because a lot of you are familiar with that and here in this file we have all the physics that are included with the physics editor there is more but for now this is what we got or this is what everybody gets with the physics editor folder downloaded it's not perfect it comes with its own limitations like right here you can see 16 fields that's for each separate chassis you can edit each line separately and have everything separately and nice and awesome but for example weights there's not that many options for weight if you change PTA weight it's gonna change all the PTA chassis there's no exceptions you cannot just change chassis 3 of the PTA weight it's all gonna go but the worst part here is that CTS trucks an original cup physics also share the weight so there's no editing CTS weight separately from cup weight anyway bunch of member jumper that nobody cares about and we're producing progressing to our second segment of this video hope I didn't waste too much time happy new year to everybody it's a big deal in Russia you know you Americans don't celebrate new year as Russians do it's like eh, over here but that's fine anyway Next, Ta -da! here we are in the second segment of the video, basically, I'm just gonna go quick, in Nesker 2003 physics, we have three parts of the physics editor, if you open up original EXE, it's gonna say right here, chassis, that means it's a part of the chassis section of the physics editor, then bum 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 bum, right down, 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 more down, chassis is a really big section, then right here it says engine, so we got values related to the engine part of the physics editor and very low at the bottom we have wheel okay wheels but that means tires okay now let me correct this real quick and add a few things it's chassis and body and aerodynamics and suspension okay like i know for a fact it's not just chassis, it's all of these included under the chassis section. An engine is pretty much engine, but it also has transmission and cooling numbers related to that part. Oh, I'm getting sick. It's okay. No brakes. We don't take the yaws. Okay, tires. It's really tires and wheels or rims. It's really both. It's not only just tires, it is also the size of the wheel, the width of the wheel, and a bunch of, bunch of, bunch of other mumbo jumbo. So we have these three sections of the physics editor that we could change in order to achieve our 500 miles an hour target. Basically, we just have to think of what we do. We can't just jump in and start changing things. We need to figure out how we're going to go 500 miles an hour. Let me find a picture of 2003 NASCAR cop car. Yes? Any picture. I'm not going for visuals right now. Boom. Bad bread. Number two. 2003. How fast does it go? Well, probably about 200 miles an hour, if it's an unrestricted engine. We could assume something like that. 
let's see. So where do we get an extra 300 miles an hour that we are missing? We have to figure out which way we're gonna go. Is we gonna, are we gonna modify the chassis and the body and make it slimmer and smaller? Are we gonna give the engine more power? Do we have to mod the tires? Are they gonna start spinning like crazy? Like for now, let me just talk about tires real quick. And in NASCAR 2003, we have we have we have come on, type type four 25 D variant wheels and tires. Okay, wheels and tires, 25 different ones. Boom, more, 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 more. They're all over the place. There's tires, tires, tires everywhere. Okay, 25 different ones for cups, for trucks, for Bush series, and for the PTA road racing physics. Altogether, we have about 24 or 25 different wheels and tires that we could swap around and mess with. So for now, we're just gonna leave tires stuck as they went right here super stuck we're not gonna mess with them cross them out we're gonna leave stuck tires not mess with that so basically we have a two choices we have a choice to go with the engine or with the body basically do you want to know how fast a stuck NASCAR car will go or what does it take for it to go 200 miles an hour what kind of engine do you have to put in it in order to take a stuck NASCAR body and frame and everything to go 500 miles an hour or we could find let's say Speed Demon not the anime <laughs> Speed Demon car okay that's better or we could modify the chassis you see super sleek and fast and could we use a stock NASCAR 2003 motor and what kind of body does it take to take this stock 2003 NASCAR engine to go 500 miles an hour even if it's if it's even possible or we could modify both we could get a brand new chassis and we could get a brand new engine with my engine pictures like something like freaking Star Wars where Luke dies you know we could modify both chassis and the engine and see how fast that is gonna go so we have combinations and options to play with and it all looks like a bunch of mumbo jumbo numbers in the physics area that are like that you see like no fucking idea what and you know what I mean but in reality what we're dealing is with this thing so hopefully it might help you to visualize something and, and see what we're actually dealing with chassis engines tires that's the stuff that we're gonna play with and this is stuff that we're gonna change it's not just blindly changing the numbers and you have to visualize what you're doing what is happening because the papyrus guys made it legit and we just want to kind of follow up their work ethics anyway I think it's enough for today or at least for this video we're gonna choose our path and how to go and what to do and pick some lines from the original EXC and put them in our empty one and start building what we got right now is a totally stock NASCAR 2003 car whatever yeah bad bright number two yeah anyway that's what we got right now supposedly if Paparas did a good job so from this we have to go to something like like that or I mean we could go any way we want actually as long as there's a reasonable explanation behind it okay my peeps later next time we will do something else we're gonna advance it's not easy and it's not cheesy smoke weed every day